What's up, YouTube? I know I've been gone for a while. Uh, I've been sick. There was Christmas. There was New Year's. Uh, what other sorry excuses can I make? Um, I'm sick again. I don't know if you can tell in my voice, but I am sick again. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you a cool little tweak that is supported on iOS 13. It's just a little mod for Zen HTML. I've already reviewed Zen HTML but I thought that this would be a cool little update. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. All right, so if we jump over to Zen HTML and we go to home screen or lock screen, select background widgets, we're gonna go ahead and review the Zenim Pro. Basically what this allows you to do is set a custom GIF any GIF that you want as your background for your lock screen or for your home screen. It'll just sit there and animate in a loop. It's a custom GIF. Pretty simple, but a pretty awesome tweak. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how to set this up. Excuse me. All right, so I'll go ahead and leave a link down in the description of where you can pick up Zenim Pro. You're going to want three tweaks. You're going to want the Zen HTML. Zenim Pro, and you're gonna want Filesa, the file manager. And I'm gonna show you exactly how to set this up. All right, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do after you download these three tweaks is you're gonna to wanna go ahead and find whatever GIF that you want, download it to your phone, and then you're gonna to wanna to open up Filesa. All right, so when you first get Filesa file manager, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and navigate to var. You're gonna to wanna to scroll down till you see mobile. Then you're gonna to go to documents. You're gonna to go to Zenim Pro GIFs. And right here is all the stock ones, plus a couple ones that I added. You need to put all your GIFs in here so that you can select them on the Zen HTML interface. And you're gonna to wanna to open another window down here. If you don't have the Pro version, just wait till this goes away. It'll let you open up another window. We're gonna to navigate to where your photos are located on your camera roll. So it's gonna be, you're gonna start right here at the backslash. You're gonna to go through VAR. You're gonna to go to mobile. You're gonna to go to media, DCIM, 100 Apple. All right, these are gonna be all the photos on your iPhone. The best way to find your GIF that you just downloaded is just type in GIF for search. Then you can go through and click on all the different GIFs that you have. I would just go ahead and long hold it, push copy, push done, go back over to that window. We're gonna go ahead and hit these three dots down here, push paste, now it's there. Then what you can do is long hold it again, push rename, go ahead and highlight the name, copy it, cancel, done. Now go all the way over to your settings, go to background widgets, add widget, you're gonna do Zenim Pro. That's gonna be the stock GIF that they have. Go ahead and push the cog, go ahead and delete this name. Go ahead and paste in the name that you copied from Filesa. Push done. It may just show a black screen or something, but just push the check mark. And now when I go home, that new GIF is now my background. It's pretty simple, pretty awesome tweak. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave it down in the comment section below. I'll go ahead and try to answer any questions that you have. Uh, Filesa. You don't want to really mess around with too many things in here. If you don't know what you're doing, just go ahead and follow this tutorial and everything will work properly. Don't delete any files or don't go into any different folders that you shouldn't be going into. Sorry for such a long break between videos. I'm trying to get on a schedule where I'll at least do one video per week. I appreciate your support and I'll catch you guys in the next one.